Hey guys, so I wanted to make this quick video today to show you how to install a really good looking um, new contact form. So if you'll remember in previous videos, I've usually recommended that you install a plugin called Contact Form 7. Um, I've recently been using a new plugin that I think provides a much cleaner design and really has a much better call to action. Um, so you'll see here, um, this is a previous site that I have made a video walking through step-by-step step everything involved in creating this website. But if you'll see here on the right side of the website, there is a little call to action, contact us. So I think this is a really good looking, kind of really clean contact form that actually is going to follow you around as you navigate to different pages on your website. So I'm going to show you how you can make this very simple contact form in this video with these key field, uh, fields here, your name, email, number, and your message. And this plugin that I'm going to show you how to install also has this functionality that allows you to install a Google map right here. So I think that is pretty cool. Um, and like I said, this contact form follows you around as you navigate to different pages on your website. So that is still there. But I think this, this plugin and this new contact form can really benefit a lot of businesses offering services or businesses where you really want your visitors to contact you for quotes or details on the services you provide. And this contact form also provides, a, I think, a much cleaner look to your, your actual contact page um, that you have on your website. So to do this, we will want to log into our WordPress dashboard. And this is a very simple plugin. I've actually already installed the plugin, as you saw here on the website. Um, but if we go to plugins and we go to add new, we can search form, form git is the name of this plugin. So here it is right here, form git contact form. And what you want to do is install now and install this plugin. After you install this plugin, you'll see this new field appear in your navigation here on the left side. It'll be titled contact form. So once you have this, this is the simple contact form um, builder here. So we'll just follow the steps here. I'm gonna click next step. I'm sorry. So we need to actually add what fields we want to have in our contact form. So most likely you're gonna to want to know um, the name of the person that is leaving you a message. So we'll just click on name. We also want their email address, possibly a contact phone number, and the message. So after you select the fields that you'd like to have in your contact form, we can hit next step. And now it's asking us to create a form get uh, account. So we can do that here, and we can also go to just formgit.com. And this is, a, of course, free plugin to have. Um, if you go to the website, we can click try for free here. And we also follow these simple steps here. So I've already created an account with them. Now I'm going to go back here to, to our dashboard here, and I'm going to sign into the account that I've created. And hit sign in. And now we'll be taken to the dashboard with form git that we have just created. Um, so the contact form that we've just set up previously with uh, the fields of name, phone number, email, and message should appear right here. So if we click there, we can see this contact form, which is great. So all we want to do now is we want to embed this contact form onto our website. So we'll just want to click on embed right here. And we want to click on embed form on your site. 
and I'm going to copy this code up here. So that has been copied. Now I want to go to my Contact Me page. So I'm going to go to Contact Me, click right there. And now I need to make sure that I click on text over here right on this page. And I'm going to paste in that code. After I do that, I'm going to hit update. Let's go to our website and let's refresh our contact me page. And we can see that this form is still there, which is pretty cool. And like I said, I think this is a much cleaner design than the very basic and simple plugin of contact form seven that I've used previously and had success with. I just think that, like I said, this is a much cleaner, cleaner look. So let's go back to our plugin here, and we can of course keep playing around with this. Um, I'm going to go to settings here, and here we'll see um, the content that we can update on our contact page. So if we go back to my site and actually click on this right here, we can see this Google map and this business address. So. I felt like this business address was a good place to put a phone number so that they can again have the phone number right in front of them. Um, so let's go back. Here is where we can provide our business address. And here is where we can actually just write in our address so that the plugin pulls a Google map. So I'm gonna type in our address, right in Osage Beach, and click Get Latitude and Longitude. And this right here, Contact Us, we can change the text that is displayed in this call to action right here. So I think that should actually maybe say, Contact Me. And here is where we can change what color the button is. So I have it as red, um, but you can of course choose a different color. I just thought that red really jumped out at you. So I'm gonna hit save changes and come back to our website. And there we go. So let me show you how you can update this text here. So you can you can write whatever you want here for this particular website, we have contact Captain Dana Shea, and then I've also written this text above the, the form. So let me just show you quickly how to update that as well. So let's go to contact form builder. Um, let's actually come right here and let's make sure we go back to our dashboard. And now here is the contact form that we've created. So let's go to Actions, and let's click on Edit Form. So here again are the fields that we've added. Um, and like I said, we can, we can of course bring more fields over. Um, but if we want to edit this part right here, Contact Captain Dana Shea, um, in these few sentences, we can put whatever we'd like there. We just want to click right here and then we can write whatever we'd like to, to show right there. So that's pretty cool. Back to our site. And now you should have a pretty good looking contact form um, with the new updated clean design.